What's up, E? I'm at Casey's getting some gas. Had to pay and change because I'm a Burke bitch. Um, but gonna go get my keto grocery haul from Walmart pickup. So follow me. Made it to Walmart. All right, here's my groceries. Let's get them inside. All right, here are my groceries. I spent $233. Yeah, not much for $233, but hopefully I can make some meals out of it. So let's start over here. Uh, we got a two pack of salted butter. I'll show the carbs on everything too. Looks like zero carbs. Perfect. Um, I got some of the sugar-free s'more syrup. I've heard mixed reviews on it, but... It has less than a gram of carbs, and I like iced coffee, so to sweeten and flavor my iced coffee, that's why I got it. Two pounds of whole milk mozzarella. I love this stuff. It's so much better than uh, the low moisture skim, part skim shredded mozzarella. It's This is just beyond. Yeah. Excuse me. Uh, got some sugar-free jellos. Got cherry, lime, cherry, strawberry, raspberry, strawberry, lime, cherry, and lime. Uh, I love making them for dessert on keto. And yeah, there's, let's see, zero carbs. Okay, and then I got a big bag of original pepperoni. I like turkey pepperoni, but this bag was bigger and cheaper, so I got it. Uh, less than a carb per serving. Um... This fully cooked bacon, fully cooked, um, it has one carb per serving. And I get the fully cooked because it's just easier than always cooking bacon. Uh, you just pop it in the microwave in a paper towel and you're good to go. Um, some Cameron's coffee. This is the kind my mom and Tim like, so I always get it. Uh, heavy whipping cream for coffee in the morning. One carb per serving. So, got that. Uh, the Ready Whip Zero Sugar. This says right on the back, keto-friendly, and there's zero carbs per serving. So, I thought it would be good on the Jello and just as a sweet treat. Oh, hit my head on the pans. <laughs> okay, we got a big pack. I don't know how many are in here. 24 pack of string cheese. Less than a carb per serving. We got 100% peanuts, crunchy, uh, five carbs per serving, wait, minus three dietary carbs, so two carbs per serving. Not bad. Uh, we got some duck fat. This is like melted, so I don't know what to do. Put it in the fridge, maybe? But I wanted to try it when cooking eggs, so that's why I got it. And Tim said it's good. He's tried it. So I just got some for the house. Uh, two things of ground turkey, 90% lean, 10% fat. Uh, these are zero carbs per serving. And I think the fat's zero carbs per serving. Yeah, zero carbs for the duck fat. Uh, some cream cheese, a two pack. Um, two carbs per serving. Got some beef bone broth. Zero carbs per serving. Some sour cream. One carb per serving. Turkey bacon. Zero carbs per serving. Walnuts halves and pieces. Uh, four carbs per serving minus two fiber, so two carbs per serving. Not bad. Uh, got some beef, frozen beef burgers. These are 100% beef. That's the only ingredient. So I thought those were perfect. Zero carbs. Uh, two bags of broccoli florets. I'm going to make uh, loaded broccoli and chicken casserole. Um, five carbs per serving minus three dietary car fiber. So that's two carbs per serving. Got some Colby and Monterey Jack. Uh, less than a carb per serving. Got four pounds. That's two pounds. Got four pounds of sharp cheddar at less than a carb per serving. Got some green onions. Don't know how many carbs. Some chicken bone broth. Zero carbs per serving. Uh, 
As you can see, I have a bunch of Mio. These are the ones with caffeine and vitamins. I like them instead of coffee sometimes and use them to take my pills. Uh, for the pills I take at night, uh, I got some without caffeine, the fruit punch flavor. And those are zero carbs, zero calories. And then we have some chicken breasts. Uh, I don't, does it have nutrition facts? Yes. Uh, zero carbs, perfect. So yeah, as you can see, not many vegetables, uh, just cause vegetables are so expensive and I wanna focus on meat and fat, really. So if I need vegetables, we have a garden going this summer. I can always use that and go to farmer's markets and stuff. So I just didn't buy from Walmart during this haul. But yeah, $233 for that. Um, oh, I also got some non-food stuff. Let's take a look at it. All right, I got some Blistex medicated, medicated lip ointment and some Vaseline lip therapy. If you know anything about me, I'm always trying to find a lip trap that works, so I wanted to try these. I got a lightning to headphone jack. Uh, I have headphones, but the jack's messed up, so I got a new one. And then some Dove Sensitive Shield. Uh, I usually don't like fragrance in anything, but my deodorant that's fragrance free is not working anymore, so had to give something a little stronger. All right, that was my haul. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like, comment, share, and subscribe if you would, please. And um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Bye.